Good morning. It is Saturday morning. It is 921. I've been up for about an hour and I'm about to FaceTime my couple for their wedding this August. I think it's August. Maybe it's June. I think it's August. Well, they'll tell me again. <laughs> but um, they just texted me. They're going to FaceTime me. I have it so I can do it on my desktop with all of my uh, materials. So... Here I am with my little FaceTime on the desktop. I've got my contract up. I've got my questions up. So I am ready to go, pretty much. Um, they're about to call me. I just told them if they call me, then I can answer on my desktop. If I haven't called them recently, um, I don't know how to call from here. Like, they don't show up if I type them in up here. So, here goes nothing. Fingers crossed that it goes well. They are already, like, friends of mine, so... There's like way less pressure than if it was with, you know, just a couple that found me. But I'm super excited. So here we go. I'll let you know how it goes. Okay, that consultation just went so well. It took like an hour, um, but we discussed a lot of things. I asked a lot of questions. I answered a lot of questions and I'm super excited. I hope that, um, I don't even know what I'm saying I hope for. We're all on a good page. So I'm gonna go uh, fix up this contract. And no, just kidding. I'm gonna shower first because I haven't showered since Thursday when I went into work and now it's Saturday. Hi, okay. It's gonna be great. Shower, pick up the house. That's not trash, by the way. That's clothes. We're not grody. Um, okay, what are these? I honestly, this, I think this like looks like um, olive oil from Popeye. You know, she has like a little, or the lady from The Shining. I don't know, but my little airplane wings. Anyway, so shower. I'm going to pick up the house a little bit because Lauren's coming over later. We're going to do Disney Plus and chill. Um, probably get some food, little snackies so we can snack while we're watching. Um, make some lunch. And then I'll work on the contract because... Just needed time to breathe. I was sweating so hard during that. Why? I don't know. I know them. We're in a good place. You know, we've talked about this before. I've already shot them once. Anyway, so going to get my day started. Super excited. Let's have a good day. Okay, I have showered. I am ready. Repping the place of employment-ish. Uh, I have not picked up yet. There is still stuff everywhere. Um, but I'm really just feeling food shopping because I'm kind of hungry. So I'm going to go grab something for lunch. Might be at a store. It might be at a restaurant. I don't know yet. But then I really want to get like one of those charcuterie boards, but like a little one. Because I have one that could work as a bigger one. But I want to make a little spread for me and Lauren tonight to snack on while we watch our movies. Um, so I'm going to go check like a Home Goods. Hopefully they have something in the sales section or clearance or whatever. Jeez, I just did this hair. What is happening? Whatever. It's real life. It's a chill day. Um, it's still kind of gross out. I'm not getting a lot of light in here. I had to like open these. I'm standing right in front of it. But people say it's warm out. Although it looks like it's raining. Doesn't that look like raindrops? I don't know, but it's really funny. This is currently connected to my Bluetooth speaker because I was listening to music and now every time I start or stop a video, it dings at me over there. It's kind of funny. Anyway, let's go find a charcuterie board, food shop, lunch shop, come back and get ourselves together. that I'm right next to a Michael's and I have a return to do at Michael's and yes he didn't bring said return but we are back to Aldi to grab some 
charcuterie stuff. Um, and then I think I'm gonna get noodles and company for lunch. Cause it sounds really good and I can order it ahead on the app and just run in and pick it up. So. Okay, so my current favorite meal from Noodles and Company is their cauliflower rigatoni pasta, and it's in like this like onion cream sauce, and then topped with the Parmesan crusted chicken. So that's what I just ate. And now I've been sitting here, and I've been watching my past Europe vlogs, because um, I'm about to see Chrissy and Vanessa tomorrow. And uh, they make me so sad. I want to go back. I want to take another trip with them because it was so fun. Oh. Anyway, I'm about to blast the vlogs, clean all this up, pack Vanessa's present, and then attempt that charcuterie board. I don't think I got enough stuff. I think I got too many crackers and no fruit and barely any vegetables but meats and cheeses are a go so <laughs> i'm gonna i think i'm gonna make it and then just stick it back in the fridge um to just sit there what is this hair doing because i'm really excited i just want to do it now currently on the second vlog of our europe trip when we were touring our little milan airbnb oh so i have gotten started on this little charcuterie board i think it's a little small but it's fine because we're not trying to like stuff our faces so here's where we're at i've got crackers this is what we're at right now i feel like vertical to save space even though i think these are gonna be my favorite ones but they looked kind of ugly vertical so i'm trying to they'll be smoothed out but then look now we have a little section for something we'll just create some more sections i've got almonds Banana chips, that's a fruit. I just remembered I have some tomatoes. Does that go? Why not? Um, I've got a cucumber I'm gonna cut up. Then I know with like brie, everyone does like a, a jam. So I got this orange marmalade. I only say it like that from the song. And then, so I got this one at, y'all saw me, at Aldi. Six cracker assortment. It's perfect be perfect i love it and it like seals itself back up so they can stay fresh okay and then i've got meats and cheeses in the fridge but so i think i went a little bit nuts i got you need a brie that's gonna be great i'm gonna cut it i think into little triangles and place it around just so it's not like you don't have to like have a knife and dig into it um a dill i know i like havarti already but then a dill flavored one sounded super good so i got that one i don't think lauren likes pickles so then i also got to save me some work pre-cut up just white cheddar because everyone wants cheddar and then i got this cute little gourmet meats like salami oh look it tells me that and hot i don't think we're gonna need the hot ones but they are touching these so we'll see and then i just got some like turkey which you like fold up real cute plus I can use it for sandwiches and stuff so that's great and that's what i have to work with so i'm gonna slice these up yeah guys it's three o'clock already holy smokes all right here is an update it looks like a war zone with the tomatoes i tried to open it upside down because these were in the bottom thing and i didn't even consider the fact of gravity and how they were all going to spill out anyway so that's what I got. They're all folded, kind of cute. Um, and I guess I'm just gonna kind of follow it this way. Cause it, right now it looks like we're arching around this set of um, crackers. So maybe I'll scoot these over and get some more color in here because it's a little bit bland, huh? 
What do we think? Look at that. All the ones that spilled out fit perfectly. Um, okay. I think I'm going to cut up some cucumbers and put them here. I had this thing of crackers over here as a pile and this one there. And then my dirty mind took over. So I had to move it. But now it looks kind of cute. Although I feel like these are just taking up too much space. And I also have to get all the cheeses on. And I think I'm going to leave the turkey off because this just looks perf. Mm. Okay, let's go. Lauren is an absolute camel. So I'm making sure I have full water. I'm going to put it in the fridge. So our beverage options are going to be wine and water. And I just feel like I'm being really prepared for my sweet little camel. All right, so I have most of it done. I had to put the brie back in the fridge to cool so I could cut it without it just splatting all over the place. But I'm pretty happy with how it's looking. Um, There it is. It's the shakiest hand ever. It's pretty cute. And then I'll have brie chunks up here. And I think I'm just going to put, or no, I'm probably going to go brie. I don't know. Um... We'll see. I don't know, I had this. This is like the smallest container I have. It's like a uh, taster, like a beer flight, but smaller, a little snifter. Sniffer, snifter, sifter. I don't know. So that's what I was thinking of putting in this, but I feel like it just looks like tall and out of place. So maybe I'll just put it in that and have it on the side. I don't know. But I think it's looking pretty cute right now. These bear, the little bear over here, but that's okay. Because we're just going to eat it, right? Let's look at it from a different angle. Oh, it's so cute. I love it. I'm so proud. All right. I am very proud to... Um, present to you the final charcuterie board I think it looks really good I just can't stop staring at it With this terrible lighting, I was like, oh, let me just bring my little board out really quick because the light is out here. Take myself a picture. I'm staring at my neighbor on the other thing. Um, here's what happened. Put down. A couple other ones fell. So now we're back inside. We're going to figure this out. Lauren is parking. I got our little board out. Seating with our little wines. I don't know if she'll want wine. She just went and grabbed some coffee and she does have to drive home tonight. But like, we don't have to go nuts. We're gonna be watching movies anyway. But, yay. So she should be walking in in a couple minutes because she had to park in a visitor spot and our visitor spots are not even close to our apartment. So that's a bummer, but Yahoo. All right, y'all, I just last minute moved it over here because we'll be sitting and watching. So it's there. Maybe I should get a... Hello? Oh, you need an actual help. <laughs> So we are so excited for the Ravens game. We just got one of the apps on the Fire TV and we're hope it's a CBS Sports. Yes. And we are hoping that it will play the game for us in an hour when the game is on. But right now we have some like pre-show, some little pre-show happening over here. Go Ravens! Woohoo! Even though Homegirl's a Redskins fan, but we like anyone in the Maryland area. So. Live in Baltimore. Get free Dunkin' Donuts when the Ravens win. Go Ravens. True. 
Will you still get one on a Monday for work? See, I don't know if they're going to continue it for the postseason or not. And it would, I would get it on Sundays, so I would get it tomorrow. Well, that's what I was saying, but, like, what if you didn't want it on Sunday? What if you wanted it for the work day? Always want to get Hey, oh, <laughs> empty cup. We got Duncan. Um, I should have shown us devouring this little charcuterie board, which was an absolute hit, if I do say so myself. Um, and I also brought out my little um, dippies and more crackers. You think? What was your favorite part about it? Um, I think you liked the, the tomatoes, which yes. I brought especially for you, and this cheese. The cheeses are fancy, and it tasted very much like a winery. <laughs> Wait, I love the burrito. I know. Lauren doesn't really like citrus, so she wasn't really a fan of the uh, citrus. This was an orange marmalade, and this was a tahini sauce for the cucumbers and tomatoes. It was super good. I keep my house kind of toasty. <laughs> Lauren knows me so well, she's predicting my vlogs. I'm predictable. <laughs> I'm such a good actress. <laughs> My GoPro has like no battery life now. And it's pretty old. So Lauren just ran to the bathroom, but we are sitting here watching old videos that we made, mostly the ones in college. And we're having a blast. We are currently on 30 cows and 28 chickens featuring Portia and Brian, and it's so funny. It's so great to relive it. I cannot believe that in May, I will be graduated college for four years. Is that not insane? Anyway, the Ravens game comes on soon. We think we have a way to watch it for free. Fingers crossed. I think I mentioned that. But yeah, Pete Vanessa's present. Oh, I can't zoom on the front camera. So we could not get the Ravens game, so we came to the next best thing. <laughs> an Aldi um, so that Laren can grab some cheap wine because we're in Virginia and she's in Maryland. So much better here. I know, just come move here. Everything else is more expensive. <laughs> <laughs> Very true. Amazing. We love it here. So here's your $3 ones. This is what we had available tonight. I like the one that you had. Today? Yes, the Chardonnay. That one. Uh, I think you would also like this because it's a little sweeter. You like sweeter or not sweeter? I like, I mean, I thought that one was good. Like yeah, so that's a good one. Yeah. So the best we can do right now is a very, very ghetto live stream of some guy who is streaming his TV on Facebook. Um, and we get his commentary and it's hilarious. Look at this, vertical and all, not even horizontal to fill the screen. It's okay. He's doing a service for the community. We appreciate. All right, y'all, it has been a long day. I'm about to edit this vlog um, until Lauren texts me that she's home. Should be in about an hour and some change, so that's a good bit of time to work on it. Um, as always, being the host, I refuse to let her help me clean up. I told her, no, I'll get it tomorrow because the dog's not here, nothing to worry about, but that's false, Lauren. I'm about to clean it up now um, while everything is importing. But anyway, um, thank you for following along this charcuterie adventure. It was really fun making this first tray um i do have one bigger one so i'm excited for the next time i get to make something probably for my birthday i know i keep talking about my birthday lauren was laughing through my first vlog about me talking about my birthday because it's over a month away whatever i have to plan ahead i'm a planner but anyway if you enjoyed this follow along there will be more and tomorrow is sunday and i'm going to brunch and ray and ellie come home and we'll be getting ready for the week so, stay tuned. See y'all tomorrow. Good night.